clap for me if you feel like I'm giving you the content you signed for. If you feel like you are seeing the content that you signed up for, clap. <laughs> so as the title says today, we're going to be doing a fashion related video finally. And do you know why it's taking so long? Because finding the right angle, in fact, the way I'm even going to do the video today, you will know that it just was not easy. <laughs> I really tried. The tripod we have apparently if you put the camera you cannot put it like on landscape mode it's so weird like there was a lot of technicalities to be honest but i said today i must film this video today anyhow anyhow so what i did was that i used my phone and i'm still using my phone to be honest because the camera was just not giving me what i wanted like when i go far it's very dark and you know about like i said i'm still not yet a pro so the settings and everything i said no no excuses sis no excuses this year if one thing is not working Go to the next so i used my phone to do like a a clip of me trying the clothes so i'm going to show you the clothes here on the hanger and the accessories and all of that but i'll put a video on the side either this side or this side or just somewhere on the screen showing you what i look like wearing the outfits because i could not my plan was to wear it and talk about the outfit while i'm wearing it and you see everything but at least give me <laughs> Give me an round of applause for trying because the most important things that you're seeing the outfit, the most important things that I'm talking about it, and the most important things that I'm making this video, and I'm going to put it out <laughs> regardless. Basically, from the title, I tried to make every outfit black owned, like Nigerian owned, black owned to be honest, because even the other one that is um, based in the UK is, is a Nigerian girl that owns it. So they're all black owned, Nigerian owned, everything owned. So <laughs> I just try to incorporate that because I feel like, I mean, black girls, we're hot, we're sexy. So it's very important to represent us very well. I have only one item that's from Zara because I didn't have the perfect skirt to wear with the blouse. That's why I had to wear my Zara skirt, but the blouse is still black owned. So forgive me. I have, obviously, I have two Ziggy Fashion House outfits because I own Ziggy Fashion House and I'm going to do what? A shameless plug. I'm going to shamelessly plug my own business. So I have five outfits in total. Two of them, Ziggy Fashion House and the other three owned by others. So I'm going to start with Ziggy and end with Ziggy. Makes sense? Makes sense. Okay, let's start. Ooh, child. So this is the first outfit. This is a dress and this is from Ziggy Fashion House. This is part of our new collection. We're probably going to, I don't know when this video is going to go up, but I think it's going to go up on Friday. Or Saturday, so you're getting a sneak peek, I guess. <laughs> Imagine if I shot the whole video and it was not recorded. Thank you. But well, how long are you? For? I'm, I'm not sure, but I'm done. Sure. <sighs> this, is, this is just happened to me now. I can't even believe it. Wow, okay, thank you. Okay, let me start from the beginning then. Bruh, <laughs> I shot the first half of this video without knowing that it was not recording. Like, the only thing that saved me was that my husband was going out and he just saw that I was just acting a fool <laughs> and my phone was not on. I can't. But thank God he came the moment he came because I would have filmed this whole video and oh Lord. Okay, take two, <laughs> take two. Some people equate um, Valentine's Day dressing or dinner date to water <laughs> and to go naked. But trust me, if you have the body for it, you go, girl. You go, sis. But the way my body is set up, I can't. I can't afford to do that, innit? So I'm going to do the one I can do. It's very, very true to my style. These outfits are very true to my style. It's something I'm definitely going to wear, like if I was going on a dinner date or something. And it has this detail in here. So from the screen... The screen will be somewhere here <laughs> the split screen of me wearing it will be somewhere here so from the screen you can see the details here on the boobs so it's kind of giving a sweet neckline so that's my my form of sexy you know i'm showing here hmm. <laughs> and it's a midi dress it has like these puff sleeves i paired it up with my louis vuitton bag so something red that will go with the red details on the dress so any red bag would definitely go and i'm wearing my black aquazura sandals so any black minimal sandals you have it will definitely go so this so this is what the first outfit looks like so guys this is my second outfit and this is from dos clothing i've talked about this brand before i called it dust clothing <laughs> it's dos clothing i talked about it. i got like a pink dress from them the last time i did a haul where i went to the interior store 
but i've told you guys they had two colors this is not exactly the same style but i decided to get another color and this color is so pretty this color is so pretty i love the different shades of green i love the fabric like they said is one size fits all so it's very stretchy it hugs your body in the right places i love the style of the dress it's just really pretty it's a midi dress as well i paired it up with my dior bag you've seen this bag before i wore it for my husband's birthday dinner and it's just the perfect pair it's the perfect pair and i wore it my minamahadi shoes i thought like that was the perfect shade of green so it's like different shades of green together and I just felt like it came together nicely. This is what it looks like, paired up with this. I feel like with something like this, since I was doing like different shades of green, that it just made sense for me to carry a bag that was neutral. So this was the only neutral bag I could think of wearing with this. I didn't want to wear like a green bag or like, you know, so something neutral would definitely go with something like outfit number three. This one you guys are going to love because People rarely see me in things like this, and I rarely see myself in things like this. Body con, body hugging, body everything. I've had this dress actually for the longest time. I just never wore it. I got it before I got pregnant or when I was pregnant. So I was kind of waiting to give birth so I could wear it. And finally, I can wear it. I'm putting all the Instagram handles on the screen. So I'll put the Instagram handle. It's a Nigerian-owned brand. I think they're in Lagos. And obviously, I'm sure they ship worldwide. Let me not mark it for them. I'm not sure. Mesh, stretchy fabric. And it's long. I have a feeling that mine is not long to the floor because of my hips and my bum but i think on a normal day from other models i've seen wearing it it's kind of longer and it has like a lining inside so it's not too transparent but i kind of wore like black inner wear so i don't have to worry about that but yeah this is what it looks like it's a long sleeve and you see what it looks like there i paired it up with my bottega gold clutch i just felt like this was perfect with it and i wore it like with a gold pair of sandals so gold gold just to go with this if i had like a brown sandals or brown bag like chocolate color that would actually go as well but i just felt like this is perfect because it goes with the brown it goes with the green the army and the black so i just feel like this is the perfect thing to wear with it and with my sandals so yeah that's what it looks like don't i look fine don't not don't don't i look fine on the screen i look fine abby mm -hmm. You would understand what goes on <laughs> when you're filming. <laughs> the kind of temptation. <sighs> breathe. <laughs> Let me just breathe because it's not easy. Anyways, talking about this dress, what I decided to do with this dress, just to show you how versatile it can be, I paired it up with the skirt that I'm going to wear in the next outfit. Let me just show you what this is. skirt. This was the skirt I was telling you guys about. That is the only Zara owned brand I have here. All of them are all black owned, but this is the only thing that's not black owned. So I paired it up with this Zara skirt just to show you guys how diverse this dress can be. So it can be a dress and it can be a top as well. So I wore it with this skirt and I still wore the clutch and the bag and everything just so you see what it looks like. And I'm sure, I, I, I think it looks good. I like it as well. So if you don't want to wear it as a dress or you're worried about your tummy, you can definitely get like an A-line skirt and wear it on top of the A-line skirt. And that way you don't have to worry about it being too tight or revealing. And you're getting like a two-in-one piece so this is definitely a two-in-one piece i like dresses like this that i could wear as a dress and as a blouse so two-in-one piece that's what it looks like for this next outfit this is like a bonus outfit this is not like the fourth one this is a bonus outfit so i, I thought i thought it looked good so i decided to just add it there today is today now onto the fourth outfit and one of my personal faves i love kai collective everybody knows kai collective everybody knows this print this print made everyone go crazy last year two years ago like this print hmm. i love it and i just got this you can still see the tag i've never <laughs> i've never worn it but i just felt like i need to add it to this video because it's the perfect chilled like you're not trying so hard but at the same time you look like you put in too much work but you didn't put in too much work i don't know if you understand what i mean and i just felt like it was the perfect mix i didn't button it up fully so i left it open to give you that sexy feel and let's not look too serious because no with blouses that's how you button it up to not look too serious like you're going to church so i had to open it i had to open it a bit just to give that sexy feel and that's what it looks like i love this color i have this i got i got two of them i got it in this green and i got it in the red but i just felt like the green just is giving me what i'm looking for the red was too red <laughs> so i decided to use the green one and it's just perfect i paired it up i paired it up with my jacquemus orange bag because of the orange detail see i'm too matchy matchy if you don't like matching sorry i like matching <laughs> when i buy a cloth i'll be like hmm i have a bag that'll go with it hmm i have a shoe that'll go with it so, <laughs> so that's what i was thinking about when i got this shirt i was like hmm, i have a bag that'll go with it this is the bag 
this is the bag that I'll go with. I think you should get it now if your size is still available because it's always getting sold out. But when I saw it, I was like, ah, thank God I got it though. So if you've been planning to get this, I think it's the perfect time to get it before they eventually sell it out and they don't plan on restocking it. And I mean, it's not that deep. <laughs> there are other bigger issues in the world. But I'm just saying, if you wanted to, I guess you should just check them out and see if your size is still available. And you should get you one because guess what? I love it. It's timeless and it's something that I can wear like so many ways. Like I style it so many ways. This is just one way. So guys, you can see I'm smiling. <laughs> you can see I'm smiling from ear to ear because this particular design just gives me joy. It makes me happy. And this is my last one. I saved the best in my opinion for last. Like it's very appropriate for this season. It's very appropriate for anything to be honest. I mean, it's only appropriate for this season because it's red. <laughs> but it's appropriate for anything. Wedding, church, anything. Dinner dates is just the perfect dress. I mean, look at me. No, look, look, I was even dancing at some point. Look at me. Eh, please. This dress is so pretty. It doesn't look good on the hanger. You know those dresses when you see hanging, you'll be like, what is this? When you put it on, it's so nice. So it has this like pleated neck detail. It's like a v-neck and it has pockets. My customers love pockets. So <laughs> if I go put pockets in everything, I'm going to put pockets in everything. So it has pockets for sure. And it's just perfect. Look at, look at the print. The print is so sophisticated is so rich the fabric is so nice i promise you guys you're going to like this dress get this dress when it's available don't just say oh wow nice get this dress i promise it is not a colorful print it's very muted if that makes sense it's very muted so that means it can go with so many things you can wear it any time of the year like i feel like it's just the perfect dress trust me and i paired it with this lovely bag i love this bag this is from bulgari and it has this gold detail like i think this is the reason i bought this bag it has this nice gold detail and i and i wore like a pair of gold earrings if you can see it in the video to go with this gold detailing and i wore my gold sandals as well to go with that so the black is the only different color but like the gold and the red you know then this one this was just perfect like look at now look at doesn't this look nice doesn't looks nice right so that's what i paired it with but i think you can wear it with any i'm sure it can actually go as well with this definitely can go with this gold with the gold sandal yes it definitely can go with that so something very neutral you can even wear with the pop of color it can go with red as well don't even play me don't play me it can go with this red. this is really nice i love it so this is my last outfit guys this was not how i expected to shoot this video at all this was not how i expected to shoot it i wanted to shoot it while i'm wearing it and i'm explaining the dresses to you guys you see it and all of that but i just couldn't get the perfect space to shoot it and i got very frustrated but i said you know what let me not use that as an excuse because i already had my makeup done and everything i was like see i cannot waste the makeup now i cannot waste it so let me just film the way i could possibly film it and the good thing with the way i filmed it is that i cannot actually make it real because the phone was on like um portrait mode not landscape so i can actually now make it real as well so I'm, i just shot two contents at the same time because the plan was to shoot youtube first then make my real but the way i did it now with the split screen i could still use the same um footage for my reel as well so it's a win-win situation to be honest i killed two birds in one stone and we're all about that we're all about content creation this year you know i'm gonna give you guys buzz 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 <laughs> so if you're happy with the content i'm making so far please keep on suggesting and I'll keep on making you know it's not easy like i said with the fashion content or things that require me dressing up and changing and giving you like a full view but if it means me doing it this way, I hope this way is not as bad. And if it means me filming it this way, I will for the meantime until I figure out how to, you know, wear it full length. And I explain to you guys as I'm wearing it. So give me um, ideas on what to do differently, on how to film, suggestions on what to film and all of that. I really appreciate those comments. I really appreciate the suggestions. And let me know what you're going to be doing for Valentine's Day. Because to be honest, with all these outfits and all this back up, I might just be at home. <laughs> I might just be at home on that day because I don't know. Let's see how things go. <laughs> it's on a Monday. So really on a Monday, like God knows Mondays are just like resting and relaxing. But let's see. Let's see how it goes. If we don't do anything or if we don't go out, fine. If we go out, fine. I'm ready for anyone. <laughs> so let me know what you guys been on Valentine's Day. And if you guys take Valentine's Day seriously, if it's just child's play for you and it's not that deep. <laughs> But yeah, any reason to celebrate, I'm all for it. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you so much, guys, for sticking with me so far. And I love you guys so much. I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye.